about Christmas Eve, COVID-19. It is the big buildup. Do people still go out on their flights? Are they going to be traveling? Well, the answer we have here in a moment. As the number of COVID-19 cases in the United States, unfortunately, has climbed to more than 18 million. We are now joined by Fox's Hunter Davis, joining us just hours away from the Christmas holiday. People appear to have ignored that CDC guidance. Hi, how you doing, Hunter? And uh, you're joining us from Dallas, Texas. Hey, Mike, like you mentioned, people ignoring that guidance yesterday. TSA screened over a million passengers heading into the Christmas holiday. That is the largest single day number we've had since the pandemic began. People just avoiding that CDC guidance that is urging them to stay home. This, as the UK confirms, a new, more contagious strain of the coronavirus has been detected in two people who recently traveled to South Africa. Health experts in the U.S. warn this variant could already be in the states, but they're urging Americans not to panic. No evidence to suggest nor reason to believe that it is more harmful for you or that it will evade the vaccine. Those things are extremely unlikely and will be proven very soon. The U.S. is also seeing another approved vaccine starting to be distributed. On Monday, the first shot from Moderna went to a doctor who works in Houston. Meanwhile, the United States has already secured 100 million more doses of Pfizer's vaccine with the hopes of getting all Americans who want to be vaccinated done by June of 2021. Now, U.S. health officials say as of now, they don't see a reason to stop travel coming from the U.K. This is Texas is among several states to break previous records of COVID-19 cases. The state reaching more than 19,000 new cases as of Christmas Eve. Mike. Hunter Davis there in uh, Dallas, Texas for us with this report. And, and Hunter, it's, you know, we're on the day before uh, Christmas here. We've been seeing this build up with our COVID-19 cases continuing to rise. We saw it with Thanksgiving. Now with Christmas, do they fear that people are, are just going to just ditch all of that guidance and then go right for these uh, celebrations? I think that's absolutely a fear, especially because this pandemic has gone on for so long. A lot of people just seem to have that pandemic fatigue, if you will, just kind of throwing all of the rules out the window, just having that, you know, it won't be me mentality, which is why the CDC is really urging people stay home. Don't travel. If you are considering traveling, they do say it might be safer to do so by car. But at the end of the day, they say staying home, wearing your mask, only associating with those people in your household is really the best way to go. Yes, definitely. We're hoping everyone stays safe uh, this holiday season. Hunter Davis there for us in Dallas, Texas. Thanks so much for that report, and you have a good holiday season as well. We continue to bring you the very latest right here on News Now from Fox, and we're hoping everyone is going to have some safe travels if they are heading out indeed. So we will keep you latest with the, the guidance that we are receiving as well as all of the updates.